Hey guys, it's Elias. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, be sure to hit that button below to subscribe. As you can see behind me, we have a whole bunch of Type R's and uh, we are here at the first annual Spring Gato Squad meet. So we're going to go around, take a look at all the different cars, who's here, who's not, and uh, we'll take a look at what's, uh, what's going on. So uh, let's go. So here we have the infamous chair. We've seen him before on videos. We know him because he is part of the squad. He's over here cleaning his uh, beautiful GD3 Honda Fit. Love that color. But you guys are not here to look at that. You guys are here to look at the Type R's. So we got a crew here from Connecticut with some beautiful Type R's. Look how shiny these are. Look at the sparkles. Check out his wing. Looking really good. Oh, he's got a carbon fiber wing. Yeah. Let's take a close look here. And it just, it just so, much, yeah. so, who made this wing? Is this the Honda one? Huh? Is the HFP wing? Yes. Very nice. That looks really good. That's the first carbon fiber wing I've seen on the Type R. Looking really good, and this is the stock wing, in case you guys are wondering. And we got our first beautiful red one right here, really stands out. Again, all three from Connecticut, as you can see. We got Lawrence from uh, East Coast FK8s, of course. <laughs> Let's see what we got over here. So I see an STI badge, but it's on a Type R, huh? Very interesting. I love the color, of course. It is the championship white. It says Boostin, and another red one. So what do you guys think? Do you have the clear side marker or the amber one? Clear versus amber. I'm actually kind of on the amber side, I'm not sure. Let's keep taking a look at other Type R's here. All right, we got a photographer, Type RN. Say hello, say hello. He's got the, he's got what, he's got the drone, he's got a sweet little camera. You guys have seen this car before. This is Sean's car, running K-Tuner now. How about we hear a little bit of exhaust and intake noise? So we got the intake first. That sounds really good. Let's take a look at the exhausts. This is a thermal exhaust. Oh, that sounds really good. That's with the downpipe and everything. Thanks so much, Sean. We're going to be seeing him at the track very soon. We're going to race him. He claims he has all this power. We'll see if he does. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. Yeah, that's right. I love his wheels, too, actually. His wheel setup is really good. Awesome. Right next to his is, of course, the East Coast FK8 car. Take a look. Another engine intake. Nice and shiny. There's a tag. And then we got a blue one. Now one thing I want to show you guys is this side marker here. This is like a smoked marker here. It looks a little modified. I like this one a lot. I think it looks great, especially on the black one. Blue one, white one, and two black ones down there. So as we can see here, this is the Type R Society, Type R, and there she is. And I'm sure you guys have seen it before, but this is the first Type R that's been bagged. And what does that mean? Show us. Nice and low. 
Wow. I never thought I'd see that, but here we go. The first Type R that's been bagged. Thank you so much. Let's take a close look here at the harness bar. Might be doing that to my car at some point. Are you going to put a um, coat over it? Pretty good. I'm gonna ceramic coat it. So. Oh, he's gonna ceramic coat it. She's gonna ceramic coat it as well. I see some tires in here. There's yeah. some tire workage over over here, <laughs> like I do. And some extra lips. And yeah, I saw that. I saw that. It's getting ready for the wide body. Lady Elmo from Type R Society. Let's head over to the Acuras. Of course, we all know this car. This is the car that I film all the time. You can see that it has the K-Tuner here. Been showing it out to people, pretty nice. I got the stock wheels on it today. Didn't feel like putting on the all season, so I left those on. And we got a matching white one right next to it. Love it. Got a sweet motorcycle right here. There's a Yamaha. What is this? What is this? I'm out of the motorcycle game. I don't even know what I'm looking at. I like it though. It's one of those uh, street fighters, they call them. They have no fairings. Definitely like it. Nice little beamer. And then what's this? This is the AE86 car from Initial D. There's a video coming out on my channel very soon. We'll finish up the filming. But I drive this and it's awesome. All original, beautifully done and restored. Look at that, amazing. He got some lips down here. He didn't have that before. That's his Instagram in case you guys want to follow him. Complete with the Japanese letters. <laughs> yeah, one of my favorite parts is his pop-up headlights, like Jane said. Love that. Now we have a modified Hawkeye Subaru WRX. Got a pretty aggressive intercooler in the front. Very popular. Hella horns. Carbon fiber hood. And these wide, wide, wide tires. I think. These are spacers, but they look proper for the track. Looking amazing. And now we get to the Acuras. Now these are really awesome looking cars. Love the wheels. Look at the wheels on this. Oh my god, these are awesome looking wheels. Take a look at the front shot here. Wow. And then we've seen this car before. This is the, one of the Acura Crew Nation cars. Take a close look. I, I've always loved these wheels. They look really, you know, I never would have thought I would have liked turquoise wheels like these, but they look really good on this car. It's bagged, that's why you see it's lowered like that. Definitely quite a looker. You won't see this car pretty much anywhere. Got a couple of more Acuras over here. He's got the Type S wheels on it. These are original Type S wheels. TL Type S, very nice. Acura Crew Nation, 
New York representing. Look at this clean Honda Accord with this nice Honda wheels. These are Honda HFP wheels. They're actually pretty rare and they look really good in person. It says, see if I can read it here. Please do not bumper fuck <laughs> my car. Camera and I will find you. <laughs> it's because I assume he parks in New York City. And in New York City, as you can see already, oh, yeah. he's got a little ding. It happens so much. My prelude, my prelude is gone. So I have a prelude that used to drive in New York City. You can see the front and back just destroyed. I like that prelude. You seen it? What? My fifth, my fifth gen. That's the race car. <laughs> Got a nice clean little Civic. We got some uh, carbon fiber here. Let's have a look over there. See you guys next time. Uh, thanks for coming. <laughs> it always looks so nice coming going down the road. The black type R. Let's take a close look here at these Acuras. So what are, what are we looking at here, guys? We're looking at here like a garbage ass car. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is sweet. This is, is 3.2 liter V6 old school VTEC Honda. Yep. Odyssey transmission garbage. <laughs> <laughs> what is that, a four speed? Five. Five, five speed? Nice. This will get down the road though. This is These are pretty fast V6s, yeah, man. <laughs> nice lights. So these uh, custom lights. Let's take a look. Put them on. Yeah, very nice. That looks really good. Yo, I just hope everything works out. Yeah, it's really good, man. I did most of the work most of myself. Man. Really? Yeah. I like the I like the color too. This car. Oh yeah. <laughs> and the tints. Five percent. My prey was like that. <laughs> I'm trying to get that windshield done. Bro. Basically, limo tint. You can't even you can't even see through it. <laughs> nice, nice. All right, guys. Thanks for coming. Uh, it's an awesome time. Had a lot of people show up. I know, unfortunately, uh, the place we originally had planned was closed down, but we called an audible, and uh, we found this awesome area right here. Like you guys saw, we saw a whole bunch of awesome Type R's, Acura's, Hondas, all kinds of stuff. So uh, I'll see you guys at the next Got the Squad meet in June-ish. I'll be planning it very soon. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.